Hey guys, welcome back. No money spent episode 69 and today, man. Oh, I have a good one. I said we're back. It's Thursday. Yes, it has been a good couple of days, I would confidently say. But as said, we have some big things. Super Bowl Part 2 drop. We got some AK stuff. Um, I'm pretty sure we also got you know a bunch of LTDs that dropped. A bunch of stuff. A decent amount of progress made. We got a new edition. A couple of new editions, actually. And yeah, ladies and gentlemen, no money spent. Let's get into it. All right. Here we are. Here we are, man. It feels feels good because we're you know back in the i don't know just the main menu but as said we have some progress made we have 500k coins we are level 44 we have 17 packs it feels good to be back doesn't it as said though we're gonna open these packs first and i'll sort of go over the decisions i've made because we have made a couple decisions we have made some ideas in mind i want to listen to you guys a little bit and see what you guys have an opinion on as we get a zero chill from the gold pluses we got these are free we got aka crew tokens I'm gonna be honest, I will admit, I haven't been doing many challenges recently. I did do a lot of the Super Bowl challenges today. I missed like the Chase Young three of those, but that's it. So, have to do those still again. It's just, I, the thing is, when you have to play Mutt every day, you sometimes do mess up a little bit. So, I totally understand. I haven't been doing dailies either. It's been rough. I know. That's on me. Like, I can't really fix that, right? I've been doing other things. I've been wanting to do other things. And so, yeah. Um, haven't been doing many dailies, but we have been making still progress over time. Even still putting in work here and there. Uh, Black History Month promo came out. Man, I remember the Black History Month work done too, man. This gives me flashbacks, man. Wow, it's, it's crazy. Also, fun fact for you guys that are wondering, I started Madden 23, no money spent, February 5th last year. And it's February 8th. We are three days ahead we've passed the one year mark since my no money spent journey ever started and wow it has been one of the most greatest series is the best series i've done on this channel and so i'm very excited that this promo is here because it sort of represents that it's like this promo is always here around the time and man that work done you guys know that work done card man that was such a good one that uh harvest aaron Rodgers, man Mad 23 was a good amount. That was a good time uh, towards the end of the year, man. That was that was a lot of fun, as said. And we've been doing this for a minute now. It's been crazy. But as said, we have some stadium packs to open. As said, because Super Bowl Super Bowl is coming up. Let me know in the comments who you guys think are going to win the Super Bowl. Me, personally, I want the Chiefs to win. Um, because, yes, I know the whole you know ordeal there with the Taylor Swift, Travis Kelsey stuff. But like besides that, I want them to win because I do not like the 49ers. I, dude, they're my least, uh, tied with Patriots, but I really don't like the 49ers, all right? I'm going to be honest with y'all. So that's probably why I don't have too much against the Chiefs, so that's why I'm sort of picking the uh, Chiefs to win it. Um, but I don't really like the matchup because it's literally a repeat and I want something new. And of course, we don't get anything new, it's just a rematch. And so that's always fun. But uh, as we get an 86 plus here, 89, I'll take it. Um, as said, though, we have some progress, man. We have some things to do, as said. Also, by the way, join Discord if you guys have to uh, hang out with the community and also to have a chance to join the CFM if you uh, fill out a CFM form. We're still looking for slots. Still have slots open here and there just because, you know, changes have to be made and stuff like that. And so, yeah, you guys can still sign up. You guys can still get in. And yeah, man. Um, anyway, though, progress. We are well 44, meaning one thing. And I'll show you guys that in a second. Compass, we are, uh, yeah. We have not been grinding comp pass whatsoever. It's been bad, man. Like, I, this is my probably, we have three weeks left practically, and we have been not doing it. We are nowhere close to the Caleb Evans, which doesn't even matter. We don't need a 94 corner. We don't. Like, I don't know why they wanted us to have a 94 corner as the guy we're going for when literally 95s are the champions in this game. Comp pass players are supposed to be like the same overall or maybe just maybe an overall down like towards when you get them we shouldn't be like possibly two overalls like champion wise ahead of them and then get them like i feel like they really messed up on the compass players this uh, season of course but it is what it is i mean i i, I don't like it but it is what it is that's why i haven't had much motivation there week wild cards we are 
Well, five, that's good. Playoffs already done with Super Bowl. We're all 13 still got to keep grinding. There's some new objectives. I was thinking about doing a certain thing today and grinding out these so I can get this token because I will show you guys in a second. It has arrived um, as we are at 613K. Yes, I've been selling a lot of cards, so understand that. I finally was able to sell the trophy back stuff and the pulls we got and then also some, uh, you know, a, a for, former starter, but there's a reason why I would uh, sell them. And uh, Black History Month, bro, I need to work on that to get those uh, B&Ds. But here's the team. You can notice a little bit of a, you know, change. Jerry Rice is here, man. Jerry Rice is on the team. Now, as said, this is our offense now. And then there's our also another addition. Ladies and gentlemen, we have Christian McCaffrey as well. That was the player I decided to choose to work on, and that's who's going to start for running back today to start the season opener. Totally forgot it was the season opener today. So I'm probably going to have to pick out unis in a second. But um, we'll ignore that for a moment. Um, as said, though, Jerry Rice is here. He is going to be our number one. Great stats, 95 speed, 95 excel, can play well. Steve Argent's going to be our two. He has short and elite instead of route tech. Jerry Rice has route tech. Devin is going to play slot. I know. Um, anytime he's playing slot. The reason is, is because I think, honestly, he'll do a lot better there mainly because he's not really the best you know like starting wide there i feel like jerry rice is more you know balanced in that case because he is like the goat wide receiver and so makes sense we also stole sold uh stefan diggs because there was no point this is the core i was talking to you about and i made it happen now i know O line is insanely weak i also think i saw a comment where i could upgrade this right tackle uh, and so I'm going to try to do that right now, actually, because I forgot if I could or could not. Pretty sure I can. Uh, here's the, I guess, the lineup. I don't know. I mean, is what it is. Uh, we're going to look here. Yes, we can uh, upgrade. Yep. And 293. Wow, that's actually amazing. So he is now a 93. Um, I'll give him playoff cam. Why not while we're at it? So never mind. We have 93 uh, right tackle now, which is good. That's actually a really good bonus. He's 94 boosted. That is really nice, actually. So it takes away a little bit of our stress there. Um, but as I said, we still have to work on O-line here and there, but I'm not sure if I'm going to fully focus on that just yet. I'm going to maybe wait a little bit. Um, as I said, though, oh my gosh, tomorrow's the ninth. I forgot about the Kyle Pitts thing. Oh, geez. Okay, well, that's not good. As I said, I probably already missed a 91 that you can get. This is, this is not good. But um, ignoring all of that, middle linebacker two is still a need, but defense is still looking around the same. Nothing new there. It's still a god squad. I mean, we. This is a. Keep in mind, this is coming off of the Super Bowl, right? So we won a Super Bowl with the squad. Uh, also, special teams has a gap now, which is not the greatest. But we'll put Jerry Rice there. Jeez, dude, our kicker turner group is looking nice. Marcus Kemp, I'm sorry, legend. You're gonna get out of the lineup for a moment though. Um because we gotta we gotta actually be able to return and uh yeah man i said there's not too much uh unis i haven't decided though so i will do that in a second but that's really it now here's the question i have for you guys i want christian mccaffrey once we get his upgrade token i kind of want to make him a 95 now you're probably wondering oh well do that well he, basically to get him to said 95 um, as I'm trying to show y'all, he has to, you have to buy a 95, uh, and put him into the set or put him into the card. Yeah. You have to add a Super Bowl champion player. So that's around 500 to 600 K, which we can't afford. But yeah, my question is, do you, do you guys think I should do that again? If we like get his light up X factor and everything, he'll become a 97 speed, 97 Excel unit, right? He'll be really good. I don't know his full abilities yet, but he seemingly will be good. He'll get good chem. I think it's a no-brainer. If if you look at the situation, we have Jonathan Taylor. Good still, right? If we do it on the other person, it'd be Justin Reed. We already have good strong safeties. Uh, mill linebacker, we don't need to worry about too much. Wide receiver, Heinz Ford, not really. It's really if we're okay with giving up like a 95, buying a 95, and then putting on Christian McCaffrey, which I'm honestly cool with. But I'm gonna let y'all decide. I want you guys to give me your takes. I may do it anyway. I don't I don't know my plan there. But I, I feel like it's a no-brainer because I feel like we don't need many positions. And I feel like that would just put an icing on the cake for this offense to start cooking again. Because we have a new wide receiver group. 
and a new tight end's coming. We're getting Pitts very soon tomorrow, which I actually need to keep in mind. Pitts tomorrow, right? This wide receiver group, plus and 95 McCaffrey with this Doug Williams card, our O-line's not even that bad. We'll probably make some upgrades. This, oh, this offense may become our strength compared to defense. Not saying something because we've invested so much in the defense. So I hope you guys get what I'm trying to get at. I hope we can maybe do something like that. I'm, I really do want to do that, but I want to let you guys give me like takes because I need them because I want to know if I'm missing something, if I'm not connecting with another factor. So let me guys, uh, geez, let me guys, know. I don't even know what I'm saying. Uh, just let me know in the comments as I said, but um, this is the squad running today. We have 600K, we're not going to spend much, but as I said, you know, Super Bowl promo and everything. And yeah, um, I said, 11 minutes in and I'm chilling and I'm ready, but I will do unis really quick. So hold up. Um, we got to, we got to walk in for this, uh, next, uh, had that season. Okay. You can transition now. And there we go. Um, I, I did it. Uh, I chose the unis now, ladies and gentlemen, there's a lot of reasons I picked these unis, but as said, we won the Super Bowl for the past two head to head seasons. It's time to go for the three P. And the unis I've chosen to do that are the Baltimore Ravens. Now, there's a lot of reasons why Mike McDonald, right? Our, our new Seahawks head coach, shout out Seattle, by the way. I appreciate y'all Ravens for you know, giving us Mike McDonald. He will hopefully serve us very well. Um, but I don't know. We just had an alternate and I was looking through unis and I thought it made sense. And I've always loved the Ravens stadium. I thought it's a really cool nighttime stadium, especially with playoffs on the line and everything. I think it'll be a lot of fun. And we're out of Texas. You know, we've done the two Texas teams. So it's time to switch it up a little bit. Thought Baltimore was the approach. Ladies and gentlemen, it's a new season, right? The last two seasons have been amazing. They have been known seasons. I mean, back-to-back -back Super Bowl wins is sort of wild for at least a guy like me. All right, let's be real. I haven't been able to do that. And so we got to dominate. As I said, we have a lot ahead of us, man. We have a lot with this team. I mean, we have a new running back. We have a new idea. We have a new plan going forward. And so I'm excited to see what we do. Ladies and gentlemen, no money spent. The new season is here, man. It is here. Let's have a good time. Now let's try to go for the three P ladies and gentlemen. Let's get into it. And here we are. That's our squad. And we're at the cheap. So GG's. Um try to do a read. And that's Jordan Reed. A read for a read. Jordan Reed. Being able to make a good uh, decision there. Just see what we can do. Maybe find a way, maybe we don't. And we definitely doubt that's a pick. I don't know where I'm throwing. Let's be real. No clue that he's gone touchdown. <sighs> you see why I don't play Madden for like a minute? I'm going to see some weak stuff right here. And wow, he does not check underneath. McCaffrey's going to get some moves. I mean, that's a first down. We're going to hurry up. Let's see what we can do here. Oh, that's Wargent. Oh, beauty. Oh, my. Okay. Okay, Doug. Cook up a little bit. Can we maybe get some here? That's McCaffrey. It's wide open. Ankles. Oh, see ya. That's a first. Let's go. Never mind. So we can run the football. Ankles, McCaffrey. Hey. Hey. Hey, man. Depends. I don't know. Maybe an underneath. Just stack the underneath. I mean, it's not there, but we're going to cut in. Doug Williams. Touchdown. Let's go, dude. Beauty. Doug Williams is able to get our self. Our, the first touchdown of the season. All right. With these Ravens unis. So let's see what they run. They're going to run the football. Oh, a read option. Okay. Okay. That was a bad coverage idea by me. That was not good. But that's game time. What? You know, I disagree. Oh, don't even try the corner. Oh, no. He just had McCaffrey for the... 
Okay, so this is gonna be fun. RPO. Okay, everything you can give this team. Because I'm ready for it. That's Jordan Reed. Over him, beauty! There we go. Kinda wild. And that's why we don't run screen... Okay. I pressed the throwaway button. And not only did he not throw it... Oh my god. He th tried to throw it to the running back. It was... I pressed right stick. He threw it to the other side! Like... What is that? Over him. Over him. Jordan Reed is absolutely destroying his team. And it's sad to see that we're throwing the ball the opposite side of the field to get a pick. McCaffrey. Ooh, okay, okay. That's Jordan Reed. I mean, they cannot stop Jordan Reed, man. Inside run, Mac McCaffrey's touchdown. Touchdown, dude. Let's go. Okay, we're on the board again. He's 42 seconds. I mean, he was able to drive in that much time. Yeah, well, it's GG's for him. Oh, game time. You gotta be kidding me. And we can't cover. And they're the most easy picks in the world. We got robbed. Like... I can't believe it. We should be tied. We for real should be tied right now. Get out. Get out. Get out. Hester's gone. Let's go. Let's go. It's game over for you. It's game over. Holy crap. Blood is rushing through my veins right now. It's game time. Right? McCaffrey owns your team. Great boy. He owns your team. This here, the confu- Oh my god, this is a masterpiece play right here. I'm gonna be real. And Jordan Reed's wide open. I don't know why you don't cover that. And he's gone touchdown. So, don't think it's cool when you do all of that and then don't expect consequences. Yeah! Do that all day! Oh, never mind. He did. Okay, guys. Game time. Out of my face. Simple. We talked about this. Conse actions have consequences. And then this is going to be just a beautiful outside run on your defense, right? Like, you can't get there. You're going to get juked on right there, right? And so, it's just that simple. I'm not seeing much from your team. That's Beck. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Oh, no. He might as well chuck my QB for 50 yards. He gets a pick six. I'm done. I can't, dude. I can't with this game. Go to war. Doug Williams is having a bad day. It's not even Doug Williams' fault to be real with you. Oh, my God. We are here. Holy crap. Hurry up. Toddy. All right. We have a chance, man. We have a chance. We just need a lockdown. Switch it, man. Yup. Nope. Can't. Can't get there. I need him to throw a pick six. And we don't run contains. Oh, I hate this game. Yeah, just chew it, man. GG. Yep. GG. I mean, I got robbed two picks. Um, I played awful. Simple. I'm gonna be real. Like, that was not... That should have been a game that we should have won genuinely. It shouldn't be those two picks could have won us the game. They could have. They definitely could have. It felt like we got robbed there, but... It is what it is, man. Like, I played bad. And so that's on me. Um, I think... I think this is another reason it shows why I don't post Madden no money spent on Tuesdays or I take a break from Madden because holy crap. I do take full accountability though. I played bad, but it is what it is, man. I love y'all. Hope you guys enjoy and I'll see you guys next time. All right, guys. Um...
Peace.